so today I wanted to make a video talking about Moroccan oil because there's a lot of info about it that I think is really important to know. Um, recently I've been using this. It is the Moroccan oil brand and it's their um, oil treatment, their regular oil treatment. Now I've used um, a bunch in the past but mind you there are a lot of imposters and when I started using this one I really did notice a big difference and it's really really great so in case many of you um, might not know what Moroccan oil is um, it's become hugely popular lately for your hair and it comes from the argan fruit which is basically a giant um, fruit that kind of looks like a giant olive or a giant lemon and it grows on this humongous like ginormous tree in the middle of the desert in southwest Morocco in Agadir and basically th this is so funny these wild mountain goats climb the tree because the tree has these crazy roots that go all the way up and then they eat the fruit but they don't eat the pits so the pits will knock down on the ground so the women of um, the region go and they make a living basically hand picking or hand collecting these pits and hand pressing the oils. Now the oil out of this pit is very, very, very precious. Um, it's so packed with vitamins and protein, it is absolutely insane. It's basically the highest concentration of protein um, that you can have. Now, women have been using this for thousands, thousands of years in Morocco and that those parts of the world. Um, but just, you know, recently it had been brought to the States, you know, Canada, um, I don't know what the exact year was, maybe, you know, somewhere in the early 2000s. But anyway, it is so, so great for your hair, and it's meant to basically give you a lot of shine, give you a lot of body, and really just make your hair completely, completely healthy. Now, I know lately a lot of people have been doing the keratin treatments for the hair. Um, that's basically just correcting any kind of damage, like if you've had really bad color or just whatever the case might be that your hair is really damaged, people are getting these keratin treatments, which basically pump your hair with protein. The only problem is if you pump your hair with too much protein, then your hair basically can break off because what it does is when you're putting the protein into your hair strands it's absorbing all of the moisture basically sucking your hair dry of the moisture and it can become really brittle and break off so you know it's kind of in in contrast to what you would think that it would do for your hair I mean it can be good maybe if you do it like once in a while, like I don't know what the right time span in between would be, but um, what I like about the Moroccan oil is it is packed with protein and it does have a little bit of the keratin in it, but it's basically going to absorb into the hair follicle, but then really, really moisturize because the oil is so just like thick and beautiful and just glides on your hair so nicely. And a lot of people say, well, oil on your hair, my hair is greasy already. Well, if you're, you know, if you have a complaint about your hair being greasy, then the problem is you might be washing it too much. I wash my hair, and I know it's not looking like anything spectacular right now, but whatever. Um, I wash my hair like two to three times a week. And if you're overwashing your hair, and it's the same concept with your face, if you're overwashing your hair, you're stripping it of its natural oils, therefore it's going to produce more oil. Same thing with your face. That's why, you know, if you wash too much, over-treat your skin, you'll probably get more breakouts because you trick your brain into thinking that you're running low on the essential oils that you need, so you have to overcompensate, overcompensate by producing more on the skin and in the hair. So basically, you have to retrain your hair um, to adjust to the natural way that it's supposed to process. So at first, if you wash your hair twice a week, you're going to be like, oh my god, my hair is so greasy. And you're going to go insane. It's happened to me, too. But then, after about a week or so, it starts to adapt and your hair won't be greasy. Like, my hair doesn't get greasy anymore. And I've been using 
this stuff every day. It's really nice because it's in a dark bottle so it's not going to oxidize and it is basically like a really really thick kind of serum-y texture but you only need a tiny tiny bit. They say use like a silver dollar amount. Um, my hair is past my shoulders and I only use like basically a nickel size, like a size of a nickel and you start working it through the ends first and then um, you know, move it up towards the roots, but you don't want to concentrate it in the roots because, yes, it is oil. Now, the amazing thing is what I noticed about this brand, Moroccan Oil, versus some of the other ones that I've used. When you put it on your hair, it, 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 it meet, blah, <laughs> I can't even talk. It immediately absorbs into the hair follicle, which is really cool because you're not feeling like greasy and slimy, like your hair is like really slick. It really, really takes to the hair amazingly and absorbs really fast. And it says that it cuts the blow dry time up to up to 40%. Now, you know, that's a really, really cool statistic, but I wanted to really test it for myself. So I timed myself and it was actually it was shorter. I don't know if it was up to 40%. But it really basically, when you put the oil in, absorbs and, and holds on to that water, but it nourishes the hair. So it kind of like takes it away from the strand. I don't know if that makes any sense, but um, it'll suck in your hair and then sort of dry it. And then when you blow dry it, it really does take less time. And the greatest part of it is your hair will still have body when you blow dry it. Because my hair is straight, like really pretty straight. Um, and my hair is thin. I have a lot of it on my head, but the actual strands are really thin, and this stuff will not make my hair look greasy, weigh it down, nothing. My hair will still be really, like, volumized and full, but it's so soft. Your hair is amazingly, amazingly, amazingly soft after you use this stuff, and basically when you keep, I'm saying basically every five seconds, <laughs> basically, 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 well, basically, um, your hair will kind of adapt to this too. So the more that you use it on your head, you know, on a day-to-day -day basis, and the more then your hair is going to really get nourished and, gr and um, grow faster and have protein and have shine and just be super, super healthy. You can use this stuff on your face, on your skin, e everywhere. It's kind of like olive oil. I know I talked about using olive oil on your face, and a lot of hair care products have olive oil in them too. So this is sort of the co same concept. And another great bonus of this is it's a natural UV protectant, which is amazing because for the summertime, that's so, so important. Even if your hair is not color treated, just to have a UV protector in your hair is great just to keep it healthy and not get damaged. So I highly re recommend using this stuff. I really, really, really like it a lot. Um, yeah, I just use it on my hair wet or whenever I wash it. You can even use a little bit when it's dry just to tame any frizz or smooth out the ends. Um, it's a great protector for if you're using like a flat iron. You know, I would still use a heat protector, um, just extra, but still you can use this. Um, and it's going to give you extra, extra protection against any damage. Um, and this is a small bottle. I'm telling you, a little goes a long way. They make really big bottles too, but I just have the small one for now. But it's really, really good stuff and I highly recommend it. Um, yeah, so if you have any other questions about Moroccan oil, uh, don't hesitate to ask because I do know a lot of info on it. And another bonus, it's good for any hair type. No matter what race you are, ethnicity, type of hair, it is honestly good for everybody. And I have a little booklet and it talks about it in there. So yeah, I just wanted to share the good word about Moroccan oil and um, happy, healthy, gorgeous hair to all of you, and I'll see you later. Bye.